we're back at the airport, that means we are going somewhere again. And this time we're going to France, uh, specifically Salbury. We're going to do some testing over there. And I'm quite excited for this one because apparently the track is really nice and I haven't been there. So yeah, let's go for that 14 hours flight. Pretty much just finished um, all the VR cruising stuff. Got my bag, arrived at Paris. Gonna be boarding the, uh, the train to uh, central Paris where I will be using another train and it'll be about another two hours till I get to my hotel probably. So, should be pretty exciting and I'll try to pronounce the, the train, which is called the train. I don't even know how to pronounce it, it's French. But yeah, should be fun. World's most confusing train station. Honestly, this train station is the worst. Like, like, I don't even know where to go. If you guys were wondering how much it costed me to uh, go to this uh, station, Paris Gare du Nord, is about 10 euros, which is pretty expensive to be honest. And I just got my other ticket to uh, the other train station using the metro, which is about 2 euros, which is not too bad. Probably the heaviest task of today is to bring this 20 kilos of stuff down the fucking stairs. All right, so we've arrived at Vierzon and uh, there's a new problem coming up right now. First of all, is that I need to find a taxi to the hotel, which doesn't exist. Second of all, I need to get cash because I didn't bring any euros as cash. So I'm just trying to walk to the uh, ATM, the automatic machine, and uh, fingers crossed if I can actually get a taxi, to be honest. So we're kind of stranded here. Literally no taxis, no nothing. Look, there's taxis supposed to be over there, but literally nothing. I tried to call an Uber, but no luck with that. So apparently the hotel manager is going to come here and pick me up. That is very kind of her. I salute that, honestly. That is amazing. Else I'll be stuck here because I try to call an Uber and there's nothing. And I was thinking of walking and it's like four kilometers away. So, But at this rate, I don't really mind to be fair. So we somehow made it to the hotel and somehow got into the translation because none of them speaks English and uh, I was just trying to uh, check into the hotel and trying to uh, use sign languages and all which is pretty interesting. So we have arrived at the track, finally got our taxis and all, um, doing prep day, got all the carts, finds over that, that one, uh, Romans. so yeah, it should be pretty good testing day today. actually do after testing yeah, session. Right. Look at this nonce. Aaron. What do you have to say about yourself? I'm a bandit. Yeah mate, duck down. Good morning everyone. I uh, just got my breakfast. Got my yogurt got from the restaurant thing. And today is a free day. So I actually don't know what to do. I was thinking of going to the cinema or something, or um, just walking around. But this, like, the town center is about four kilometers away, though, so that's gonna be a bit of a walk. There's no taxis or anything, as usual. And today's weather is shit. It's fucking gloomy. So honestly, I might as well just stay in and 
watch Netflix or something. I don't know. We'll see. But we might be watching football. Man City versus Tottenham tonight. So should be pretty interesting. back well actually no this is my new apartment i'll probably give a room tour for you guys but later on that so back in rotterdam got my luggage and all so yeah thank you guys for watching hope you guys enjoyed it and yeah it was a pretty good testing weekend for me i really enjoyed it especially with a little excursion with bowling and all so yeah that was that was really nice but anyhow i'm sleepy about just to die and yeah see you guys next time